Hi, I'm David Akimi. I'm a realtor with Berkshire Hathaway Home Services here in Denver, Colorado, and I'm one of the area's top agents specializing in new construction purchases. Today, as part of my series on new construction topics, I'm going to take you into a Lennar sales office, and we're going to talk to Sarah Melzer, the salesperson there at Morgan Hill in Erie, Colorado. She's going to take us through, show us her design boards, and give us a Q&A on everything you can expect when you approach Lennar or an everything's included builder like Lennar. Let's go talk to her. So today we're here with Sarah Melzer of Lennar Homes. We're in a Lennar community in Erie, Colorado called Morgan Hill. And Sarah has been kind enough to talk to us about Lennar's everything included model. That's gonna be the first uh, builder business model that we cover today. They have some really cool benefits. Sarah can tell us a little bit more about it. So we do the everything's included package. That mm -hmm. means that um, you know there's really no customization, but you get a lot for your money. Mm -hmm. So more or less all of our homes come with refrigerator, gas cooktop, um, you know, smart technology, solar energy, covered decks, basements, um, you know, a lot of the things that other builders charge for, um, even like rocker switches, nine foot ceilings throughout the main floor, air conditioning, garage door openers, all that stuff costs extra with a builder who's, um, you know, allowing people to pick options. With us, there's really no customization, but you get a lot. Sure. And you know, I bought a Lennar home myself, so I can speak to this a little bit. I've gone through the process with Lennar. You're telling me that these days, in order to keep pace with your building schedule, you guys are pre-specking most of the homes. But to that effect, there are maybe three packages that they get spec to. Is that a fair assumption? Yeah, there's three different design packages. So there are some variations with the design materials themselves, but more or less we pick those before we sell the home. So if there was a particular design package that somebody wanted, I would direct them to a home site that has that. That already has plan. it. Sure. Yeah. And when you say variations in the materials, we should clarify it's not necessarily like a design center builder where you can pick multiple grades of flooring. It's all basically mm -hmm. the same grade of flooring, yes. but you do maybe offer a light color, a dark color, a middle color, that sort of thing. Is that right. a safe assumption? Yep, there's okay. two packages with white cabinets. There's one with dusk, which is like a darker option. Okay. Um, you know, there's quartz throughout the house, but there's a couple different quartz colors. Mm -hmm. um, so exactly right. Um. <laughs> yeah, you, you limit it, but it keeps it a little bit more streamlined. And yeah. I think you order everything with quantity, with uh, economies of scale, essentially, so that you're mm -hmm. getting probably better pricing. I know with Mylan, our home, mm -hmm. the build process went quite a bit faster because it didn't seem like you guys were having to work around every single home's varying blueprint and custom selections. You were able to get through the build process a little bit quicker as well. That's right. It does make us super efficient as yeah. opposed to builders where there's outlets in different places in every single home. We have a really strong structured timeline and mm -hmm. our trades are able to just go from house to house. That allows us to stick to our dates and you know really we have a six month mm -hmm. build time where other guys are saying 12 to 15 months and then maybe it's 18 or 20. Yeah, no, so, I can attest to that. You guys definitely get it done quicker and you don't really compromise on quality. I think it's just the fact that the process is more streamlined. You don't have multiple vendors. You don't have multiple structural options that each and every homeowner picked on every lot. You're able to just kind of stick to the plan and get them knocked out quicker. And another thing you mentioned, this also allows us, you know, we, we, we build a home whether we have a buyer for it or not, and then we find them later. Sure. So, you know, some, some builders might only build one if they sell one. Mm -hmm. That doesn't allow for a lot of opportunities for, you know, interest rate incentives and things like that. So uh, we generally have inventory. If somebody is looking for something quick, you know, we generally have things available. So. Yeah, and that's a really valid point. A lot of the builders, Lenar included, like you mentioned, have the ability to buy blocks of mortgage money on the secondary market at below market rates. Like what, what's your current rate on a 30 year fix if you've got one that qualifies? 4.5. See, 4.5. And right now the open market rates are closer to six, six and a quarter. So you're able mm -hmm. to offer interest rates well below the norm. Mm -hmm. The caveat with that though, with most builders is it has to be one that can close before a set date. So yeah, it's generally a couple of months that mm -hmm. we have national financing. But like you said, because you guys start pre-building some spec inventory, you usually have several that are going to be done in time mm -hmm. that somebody can walk in and feasibly get it. That's one of the things I see with a lot of the other builders. They dangle that carrot, they have it in all their ads, but when you come in, they say, well, it's got to be a home site that can close within the two month period. And guess what? They don't have any because they don't pre-start them. Right. Lennar builds ahead so you can actually honor your below market mortgage incentives. Yeah, very cool. Absolutely. Well, well, hey, I appreciate you talking to us a little bit today. Do you think we can take just a little bit more time and go look at some of the panel selections in there so we can sure. show everybody? Can we walk in? Yeah, let's yep. go on in. Okay, so one of the really cool things that I've noticed about Lennar is even though the selections are limited, 
whoever makes these uh, selections in your corporate office is really in tune with the market. But I will say that if we were going to go to a builder that had a model home and gave you the ability to pick a lot of this stuff, most people would pick pretty close to what you guys have as pre-done selections. Yeah, we hear that a lot. We occasionally have folks who have been under contract with another builder and then come over here and they go, oh, that's almost exactly what we picked. Yeah. It also spares you the agony of having to compromise at the design center. You know, a lot of people, no matter what your budget is, they go to the design selection meeting and then decide that you know, they're good. No matter what the budget is, you're having to compromise on things and they put the nicest selections out front. <laughs> yeah, I would agree with that. The white cabinets for the last few years have been by far the biggest uh, number one choice of most people, but a lot of builders charge so much more for the white cabinets that people who want them can't quite fit them into the budget, but you guys have fixed that problem. And quartz countertops throughout the house, that's a big one too. Yeah, all of your quartz selections are high-end white. Uh, you know, these would be probably group three or four, so this is super expensive choices. If you went to a design center builder, you'd have to pay big time to upgrade to these quartz selections. The nice thing I see here is you, you're not gonna force anybody to take like an ugly tiger stripe, old 1990s uh, Santa Cecilia granite in order to keep within budget. You're gonna get the nice quartz that you want just exactly. with the price of the home. Hey, thank Thanks, you again. David. Yeah, Appreciate come it. to Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> if you're here in Erie, Colorado and coming to Morgan Hill, call me. I'll bring you to see Sarah if you want to see it, or of course you can walk in and see her, but if you want agent representation, as you know, it's always free. Can't go wrong with David. Yeah. Thanks again. <laughs>